U.S. Army soldiers deployed to Combined Joint Task Force Horn of Africa, alongside French partners, recently completed the initial phase of the French Desert Commando course at Arda Djibouti, moving one step closer to earning the coveted French Desert Commando badge. Three, three different parts. Uh, the first part was how to live in the desert. For example, how to find some water, how to cook, how to purify this water to, to, um, to drink it. The second part was how to make some simple food, like uh, the, we call it the desert pancake, and some tea, the traditional Ethiopia, Ethiopian tea. And uh, the second part was uh, more collective with a uh, te uh, team obstacle course uh, by day and by night. We and uh, the last uh, part was uh, this one, like uh, behind me, uh, in individual course uh, with uh, some uh, high point of view, uh, with uh, port climbing, mm -hmm. things like that. Uh, and it's for just for, for yourself how to um, to move and um, to overcome uh, your fear, your fears of, uh, of the vacuum, of the empty space, things like that. This was not only an opportunity to earn a foreign military's qualification, but also allowed for a cultural and military exchange between U.S. and French soldiers. You get to exchange ideas and thoughts with them outside of you guys doing the actual course. So you get to talk to them one-on-one, -on -one. you get to see how they do things, how they move tactically. Uh, we did some land navigation. Um, we, I, I built my first fire here, which was awesome. I've never built a fire on my own before. I, uh, I have appreciated these moments, these three days. Reporting from Arda Djibouti, this is Petty Officer 2nd Class, Timothy Ahern.